new wide-ranging 25-year study has called into question how useful mammograms are in saving lives. Here now, three sources of the debate about mammograms. Number one. Mammograms may not reduce your risk of death from breast cancer. These Canadian researchers showed that the number of deaths from breast cancer and all other causes was about the same in women who got an annual mammogram as it was in women who didn't have one. And mammograms can have side effects, which brings us to fact number two. Mammograms expose women to radiation. And every year that you get one, as currently is recommended by many organizations like the American Cancer Society, that means that every year you get another dose of radiation. And with that risk also comes the possibility of overdiagnosis, which this study says happens to one in five women. Finally, number three, the science on mammograms is complete. Well, actually, no. Doctors are still figuring this one out. This study isn't perfect, no study is, but it means that every woman needs to sit down with her doctor and have a conversation about screening based on individual facts. Does breast cancer run in your family? Do you smoke? How old are you? Are you overweight? All of these things may change the conversation and the eventual decision that you make, and it may be different than the one your best friend has with her doctor. Increasingly, we're going to see more of these conversations about when or even if to screen for cancer based on our own genetic makeup, and that means we're going to be guided by our own DNA.